The ancient Greeks had a god for just about everything. Love and war, even parties and drunkenness. Sadly, it seems, no god was ever assigned to picking up the tab. There's no way Greece can ever settle its $435 billion debt. With a GDP of $242 billion, or half the size of the New South Wales economy, it just isn't possible. Greece and debt have an unhappy history. It first defaulted in 400 BC, and since 1826 it's defaulted five times, most recently during the Great Depression. This time, there's more at stake. Not only would it be the biggest sovereign default in history, it threatens to blow up Europe. Greece should probably never have been admitted into the Eurozone. Why? The Greek government hit up to 10 billion euros in debt, with a little help from Wall Street titan Goldman Sachs, before being invited to join. This was only discovered in 2010 during the global financial crisis. But once you're in, there's no mechanism for leaving. For a start, resurrecting the drachma would be a logistical nightmare. Most Greeks want to remain in the Eurozone. They just don't like the conditions. This explains why. Austerity simply hasn't worked. Greece's economy is shrinking, so the ratio of Greece's debt to GDP is blown out to 180%. No one wants the Greeks to go. The word default has now been replaced with arrears, because a so-called Grexit would create a dangerous precedent for other troubled member states, which could trigger an EU collapse.